Well, good morning. It's the uh, 2nd of August, 22, day 2 of the Scotland tour. And we're just leaving the centre of Britain Hotel for our day 2 and our next destination being the Holiday Inn Express in Perth. And we're going via Kilda Forest, Hulkirk Wheel, the Kelpies, and then up to the Holiday Inn in Perth. 215 miles today. We did 257 miles yesterday. So, just first stop petrol, and then we're away. So, I think we're right to the petrol station. He's around here to the left somewhere. Uh, and we're going to find fuel and then we'll be underway. So yeah, it's some rain overnight. It's stopped raining now. It's quite nice, quite warm, 20 degrees. And uh, we're ready for uh, another day's ride. Lovely place we stayed. The uh, Centre of Britain Hotel up here in Hawk Whistle. Very, very nice hotel. Highly recommended. Uh, we had a delicious, uh, delicious breakfast, and last night we had uh, we had a curry. We went and found a little uh, Indian restaurant had curry. So here we go, Gulf Petrol Station. So I say, this first stop is for us to pick up fuel. I think I've been here before, and then once we're fueled up, we'll uh, we'll start the journey proper. Yeah, all okay. good mate. Okay, left ear back around way with the way we just come. Okay mate. Warm meat. I'm bloody cooking. Cool. Cooking. <laughs> oh, cooling down a bit now. Standing still, I'm sweating like Shane McGowan's dentist. <laughs> 257 miles we did yesterday. 257, crikey. We got 215 today. I say, Looks like a pistachio nut. Looks like a pistachio nut. <laughs> 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 like a pistachio, yeah. Fuck you now. He brought me some hat and all this. I know, we told him. Told him to get the chain. Might not work very well, but when he does, we could have a bit of banter. True, yeah, that's right. 6318. For future reference, B6318. It's glorious, bloody hell. We're turning right. Bit in there. Put in that for that dinner in there. You know. Yeah. Yeah. But well, I was telling Brian when we come up uh, in 2019 with Paul and everybody, we fueled up at that petrol station. Yeah. And we've had dinner in there. There's a tree on your left down here. It's that uh, Kevin Costner tree. I'll try and keep an eye out for it. Like I'm a, from Robin Hood, Prince of Yeah, it's like a tree between two hills. It's on the left down here, keep an eye out for it. Oh dear. Okay. I think 
Yeah, fucking good, good tour guide, guide I am, and I. How to do this for a living? You're <laughs> We got 13 miles on this. This is a Roman road because it's dead straight. Adrian's Wall's over there somewhere. I think yeah. you'll, you'll see it in a minute, Adrian's Wall. Bits of it, anyway. over there as well somewhere keep an eye out for that tree it's between like two hills oh did you mean the, uh, oh, the wall I oh, know, it's not twisties only though, no, I don't like these sort of roads. I like, uh, I like twisty turny roads. Twice Brood, that's the name of this little place here. Twice Brood. This is the name of this place then, Dave. Yeah. Twice Brood. Yeah, Twice Brood. Strange name for a little town, eh? Or village, or whatever it is. Looking for that tree. I oh, never see the day. I'm not looking for the tree. There's a twice brood. That's Adrian's wall up on the top there. is Kev. You're just coming up to it in a minute, between those two hills. Amazing. Awesome, isn't it? Awesome. Look at the tree on the left. You see the tree? You see the tree? You see the tree, see the tree in between them two like um, hills? To your left. Yeah, yeah. That, that was the, that was the tree. That was in Robin Nook, Prince of Bees, when the little kid got chased up the tree. Or the King's Hounds. Oh, yeah, yeah. Huh? Kevin Costner. There you go. Beautiful. So we're ready towards our first stop now at uh, Kilda Water. Kill the forest. Lovely stretch of road this is. I thought I'd uh, capture it. This is a great stretch of road, Kev. Okay, mate. Lots of twisties. Yeah. No, no, I'd like to find the twisties for you.
try and get past this thing. Still there, a pull. We lost him. Paul. Just still there, Paul. Oh, he's dropped off. He's still there behind us. Yeah. Oh, he's here. He's here. He's back. got up there. Turn around, sorry chance. That's two mistakes today. I know you're totaling up how many fuck-ups I do. I know you're doing it. <laughs> and I don't care. <laughs> Indicators on, Dave. Top. Car coming. Two cars coming. We're all right. All right, mate. All right. Bit of shit in the middle of the road. Watch out for that. Oh, okay, mate. This looks nice. 
Oh, I can see him, I can see him. I'm not far ahead. I'm taking it easy because it's a bit narrow. I can see him. Let's keep going straight. <laughs> Is there a, uh, there's a chipmunk on the line? Van coming. Right, where the fuck is he sending me now? Look straight on. Yeah, I think this is correct. There's a darling, there's a darling chipmunk on the line. The road. And, uh, I don't think I've done this one before. So, yeah, nice. Hasn't got a name or a number to go to the sat nav. Just road. Paul, oh, you'd like this one. Another little bridge. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Little waterfalls there. Gorgeous. Oh, this looks interesting. Don't want anything coming the other way, thank you. Awesome. Is that a dam? I think so. We're on the road to uh, Shilling Pot now, or Falston and Kilda. That's where we'll be taking our first break at Kilda. Look at the reservoir. I love this road. We did this back in 2019 when we did the Northumberland tour. And uh, it's an awesome stretch of road. Here's the hotel or B&B that we stayed in, the Pheasant Inn, on our last visit. Or the 2019 visit up here, we stayed at the Pheasant Inn, lovely, lovely B&B. And uh, yeah, that was just going to take me up there. No thanks. So we should have the reservoir, Kilda Reservoir, coming into the site. So again, we're uh, just left Kilda Reservoir and as you can see, the weather's a bit bleak so uh, 30 miles into the journey, it's quarter past 10 and we're heading off up now towards the Scottish borders and eventually uh, towards Perth so uh, Kilda Forest to try and do now 
windy, it's blowing wind, it's quite windy through here, rain, not very nice, but we, uh, we've had a revisit to uh, an old one of our places that we liked, so moving on now, I'll rejoin you, well, I'll leave the camera running for a little bit, see if we can capture some of the scenery, other than that, I'll rejoin you later in the journey, and hopefully the weather has taken a slightly nicer turn. So I'll see you in a bit. Alright, well we're back. Still raining. We're now on the 6088, uh, following the river through the valley. And uh, yeah, we're 57 miles into the day now. Uh, it's 16 degrees. Uh, we're a little bit cooler than yesterday, a bit wetter than yesterday as well. Love to watch the, love the way the river's flowing down the valley, beautiful. Um, so yeah, hopefully we'll be out of the rain soon. It's it's not it's not too bad. It's not the sort of uh, rain we had in our garden butte. I can see where I'm going on this occasion. Uh, so just to say, we're coming up out of the valley now. I've got this Dutch road again, if anybody wants to see it, I've got it in both directions back in the 2019 video uh, when we had the, uh, we did the tour up here so, so I'll come, there'll be a link up uh, in the corner if you want to have a look at that but I'm not sure, I passed a sign back a little while back that said Scottish Borders Welcome to Scottish Borders, I'm not quite sure whether we're over the border yet or not so, we may be in Scotland, we may be in England, but we're somewhere on the uh, boundary of the two. So this is an awesome road. Look at this. Yeah, last time I did it I was on the uh, Triumph Explorer, Tiger Explorer. So this is the first time for the, uh, for the Tracer 9, bloody hell. That was a bit nasty there, just slid a bit on the cattle grid. Make sure the boys are all through that okay. Is it a good idea to put a cattle grid on a sweeping bend? Let's just hold back and check that's all through okay. I really don't like it when you don't see the lights because that cattle grid was nasty. Here's Kev. <sighs> yep, they all, all got across it okay. Yeah, a little slide there on that. Health and safety. Don't put cattle grids on sweeping bends. There's a sort of river running down in the bottom down there. I don't know whether you can see it down in the valley. Stunning. And this, uh, I say this road is just twisty after twisty. The 6088 if you want to come and do it. Sun is out and we're on the 698 now. And we're out of the rain. Let's hope that's the end of the rain. And what a road this is. The A698. What a road. Trace and I loves roads like this.
bloody awesome. Right, this road we're on now, we're 81 miles into the journey, it's 11.35am and this is the B709 and we're on here for about 8 miles, 8.6 miles and what a, what a beautiful scenery to look, you know, vista to look at, wow, stunning. Beautiful. Oops, starting to run him down. I think he's a grouse. This looks a lot like uh, New Galloway Forest Park. <coughs> Beautiful. A uh, lake or a reservoir on our right here. Just looking for the guys in the mirror. There they are. So, yeah, then we got something on the right to have a little look at. If it breaks into the open at some point. There it is. Looks like they've got a bridge across it coming up. That should be nice. Let's have a look at this. Wowza. Beautiful. Beautiful. But yeah. Found some great roads. Awesome. Flowers bloom absolutely bloody gorgeous. Wow, amazing! God, I love these places. See you again shortly. Just bloody wow. Wow, wow, wow. It's just stunning. Stunningly beautiful. Oh. God, I love the countryside and the wilderness.
meanders round and joins us again. Oh, big wagon coming up here. This could be interesting. Oh, two of them. Okay, now. Oh, shit. That was interesting. Anyway, where were we? We're enjoying the river. <laughs> Slightly Ross wider roads, please, Scotland. Just another six foot will do it. Anyway. Hopefully that's the only excitement for today. B7062 and in the general direction of Moffat I believe. But who knows? <laughs> and who cares? Just look at that. Just look at that. That is just oh God it's just awesome up here.
look at this. I need to be losing some layers soon. It's like it's warming up now. Uh, stunning. See you in a bit. 